You know, something else that I don't claim to have a gift at is being able to tell the future. Do you claim that gift? I do. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the future, according to Rent. Now, of course, tonight is what? Fast food show. The fast food show. My future segment relates directly to the future. All these fast food joints around the town of Lillington, we have Burger King, we have Hardee's, McDonald's. We have Wendy's. We have McDonald's. Bojangles. But I'm only going with the big four. Oh, okay. Okay, and I'm, I'm calling Hardee's one of the big four because it is known as Carl's Jr. in other places around the world. They're always introducing new sandwiches, and what better thing to predict than what sandwich will be coming out next? Or what item, really? Not just a sandwich, but what item will be new to the menu in the near future, because okay? What, because they all have new items that they bring out, and it's like a marketing scheme to get you back into their store. It's like, oh, Wendy's, you know, oh, look, they, they've got a cheese now that has incendiary pepper specks in it. Well, it's called Pepper Jack Cheese. And I'm going to have to go back. Wendy's did not invent it. They just commandeered it for a sandwich. Yeah, but they put it on a, they put it on a chicken sandwich, and all of a sudden they got a totally new sandwich, and, oh, you've got to go back in there and get that. But what, what I am doing is I am observing the trends of the local fast food places. And I am making an extrapolation, as I always do, because I'm so in tune with the present, I make an extrapolation as to what the future will bring in the form of a new menu item at a fast food place. Let's start with Burger King. Burger King has gone bacon crazy. Burger King has the Baconator. You know, it's got the cheese. and It's, got, it's basically random stacks of bacon, cheese, and burger and bread. And that's like a sandwich. That's their new thing. Bacon stacks or something like Lots that. Lots of bacon. I mean, add, add bacon. I believe in the theory. Add bacon to anything, and that anything becomes that much better. But I think that based on this trend towards bacon, the next thing to be introduced in the near future at Burger King is bacon Coke. Bacon beverage? Bacon Coke. Bacon Coke. But Coke would come up with that. Well, no, but it's going to be a partnership deal with Burger King. Or is it like you get your Coke... Only available at Burger King, bacon Coke. <laughs> or is it like you get your Coke and then you can just add a squirt of liquefied bacon? No, it's not bacon flavoring. That already exists at many local coffee shops. All right, Hardee's, also known as Carl's Jr. to you freaks on the West Coast. No, Carl's Jr. is in Washington, D.C. Okay, and you freaks a little bit north of here. Uh, Hardee's, they, they're known Our for... nation's capital. They're known for the big stuff. The monster burgers. The obscene commercials with Paris Hilton eating big burgers. You, they're just really big burgers. That's do, do big we, sandwiches. Do we have a clip of that? <laughs> we don't have a clip here on the family-friendly Rhett and Link cast live. But well, you all know what I'm talking about. You have a television. Now, Hardee's likes to introduce the big stuff, but the Hardee's in Lillington, and if you work at Lillington, the Lillington Hardee's, please listen, we do not go to the Hardee's in Lillington anymore, the Lillington and Hardee's, the Hardee's in Lillington. We're boycotting it. Because you burn everything. Everything is burnt, and nothing looks like the picture. Not even, I know it shouldn't look exactly like the picture, but it looks like you took the picture, and you said, I'm going to do the opposite of the picture, and that's what the sandwich is going to be. Lillington Hardee's, that's what happens at your establishment, Okay. Yes, and it, so we stopped going, but evidently most people in Lillington don't stop to think about it's still crowded. What they're, what they're, what's happening and how the food tastes. Lillingtonians, if you stop and think about it, you will no longer go to the Hardee's in Lillington. This is not Hardee's nationwide. This is Hardee's in Lillington. And you know, you know what I could, I could, I could do is I could, you know, I could work there a couple of weeks and turn things around. Well, at least try. But this is what's going to happen. I would, I would cook things a little bit. This less. is a local, this is an isolated release. This will only happen at the Hardee's uh, of Lillington. This is going to be called, the new menu item is, the every ingredient we have in the store put on a big bun and burnt burger. <laughs> Wendy's. Here, here's what's going to happen at Wendy's. Wendy's is sort of the look down our noses at other fast food chains, of fast food chains. Because their slogan is, Wendy's. It's not fast food, it's Wendy's. No, that's not true, first of all. Yeah, it is. Isn't that their slogan? Well, it, aren't they a fast food restaurant? Yeah, it is fast food. I don't like Wendy's. 
But Wendy's, they, they say, okay, we have, we have special salads with oranges in them. And we have potatoes. And we have chili. We're better than you. But you think that's a good thing, right? Well, you know, I think it, it, it does make it a little appealing. <laughs> Not their attitude, but their, but their wide selection of, of uh, interesting stuff. Variety. The chili's what? Good. The chili's good. Nana says the chili is good. It is good. Now, but here's what's going to happen, because they're always trying to up the ante, to, to rub the other fast food places' noses in their chili and their bacon, uh, or their uh, baked potatoes. <laughs> Their new Burn menu item, the bacon. Their, their, Wendy's new menu item in the near future will be calamari. Fried calamari? Fried calamari. Very chewy. Yeah. Very chewy. I think whenever they do the commercial, because I'm with you on it I, think it, I think it will say, and now new on the menu, calamari. And then there'll be a pause, and then they'll say, very chewy. No, that wouldn't be appetizing. Squid. And the last one, very chewy. McDonald's. McDonald's gets a bad rap, just like Walmart, but the, you know what? They're, they're a powerhouse. They're, they're a powerhouse. They're doing the right thing. Over 31,000 <laughs> locations worldwide. They own Boston, Boston Market for seven years. They just own Boston Market for seven years. I'm going to own you And then said, years. I'm going to sell you because I can. <laughs> you know, the thing about McDonald's is they're always inventive. They're always coming out with something new. They're, they're, they're the innovators. They're the, the industry leaders. And they're always making stuff up. <laughs> McDonald's will take anything and just mick it on up. So what's going to happen? They're going to come out with McSketty. <laughs> uh, like in a bowl or on a bun? Uh, it will be in a little styrofoam container. It will be spaghetti that tastes like it came from McDonald's. No, I th <laughs> you know I think, what I'm talking about. I think to save money, they will not put it in whatever you just said because I wasn't listening. They'll just put it in a medium Coke cup. It will come on... <laughs> It will come on the same thing that they serve the large breakfast platter on. <laughs> yeah, yeah, and they'll just, it won't say that on the top. But it'll but be you can tell that that's what it is. It'll be just like your uh, your high your your, Big breakfast. your middle school lunch. It'll be mixed already. Yeah, yeah, yeah. The beef. or it will come. The noodles will come with a packet of meat, and you're like, no, no that would be if it was at Wendy's. Yeah, because they, they want you to feel like you're you're a chef. <laughs> They want to do that in the uh, back at McDonald's. That's kind of what the chef does. Yeah. Is they they mix it up in the back and they bring it out for you. <laughs> they put it in the microwave. They mix it together. Ladies and gentlemen, this has been one of my favorites so far. <laughs> the future. According to...